My name is Cindy Egg and welcome to Fast Food Simulator, a potential series only if you guys enjoy it. Now, if you're an OG subscriber, you'll probably remember this game to be called Fast Food Tycoon. And it's literally like, like, um, like, like, uh, what's gonna, like, retail tycoon kind of thing, but you're building your own fast food joint. You can basically build your own McDonald's or Burger King. It's pretty cool. Uh, it's kind of been revamped, re-updated, a whole new thing's added in, and it's now called Fast Food Simulator. And I thought, because it's been revamped and kind of just brought out, We'll come back and we'll play it again. So guys, if you enjoyed this and want me to turn it into a series, then make sure you smash that like button down below. Leave a comment saying, Celiac, you're full. Play some more and we'll do just that. But ultimately, guys, we're going to build the biggest, the best fast food restaurant the world has ever seen. Now, it's been a while since I've, I've last played this, so I can't exactly remember too much in how you do things. Um, some people already started to build. Oh, that dude's got a beastie, a beastie little fast food restaurant right there. So I think it's only fair that we go to the help section and play or view at least the tutorial. So in a fast food simulator, you start with a pre-built tycoon. Firstly, you need to select the furnish tab, go to the kitchen, place down the grill, the fryer, the fridge for your workers to use. Right, you got this, boys. We're going to build the kitchen first to create the delicious city burgers that we're going to be serving all the customers. It's going to be juicy. Uh, okay, once you select the object, right, sweet. So it's just like the kind of fryers. I kind of remember that. Build your counter, put down a little cash register, and then hire some staff. Kind of got that. Get the supplies in, the stocks. So we've got the ingredients to start cooking. And then it's all good. Right, I think, I think I'm ready, guys. I think I am legit ready. So I've got 8,100 to start with. And I think to make us a little bit extra cash, I'm not sure if you can actually physically sell. Let me see, let me see. Can I, can I bulldoze the ceiling? Okay, I get extra money for getting rid of the ceiling. I'm going to get rid of that just because, you know, gives me that little bit extra cash. <laughs> oh, boy, he demolishing. He demolishing. So somehow then... With this, we gotta try and squeeze and fit in a pretty beasty uh, fast food joint. So we're gonna start off small, and then we'll eventually expand as we get more money. And if you guys want to turn this into a series, we'll just continue to build up and up each episode. It's gonna be pretty damn dope. So in the furnish option, then uh, we need to go to the kitchen section, and we need to buy the fridge, the sink, the grill, and the fryer. So I think we'll get the fridge. Okay, so we gotta place it kind of one down there. So I place the fridge there. The grill will place here. The fryer there. I'm gonna kind of run out, slightly run out of room, aren't I? Right, services, cash register, but I need a counter to drop down. So what if I place down a counter here? Right, bear with me a second, guys. Cash register there. Now, um, can I, wait, 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 services, no, kitchen, kitchen, sink. If I drop the sink here and we put like a wall there, we kind of create like a small little window inside. It's kind of dope, isn't it? Oh man, this is so exciting! Right, okay. Um, so I, I can't afford to put any seats in, so unfortunately no one can come in and, and sit down. Um, I don't know if that's a bad thing to begin with. We could probably get, get one seat in. But let me get off this screen. Because when we get to the build section, we need to get a wall. So we get like a, a wall in there. I kind of want it there, don't I? Or do I want it there? Okay, I'm going to place it there. We might have to demolish something else. I'm going to kind of move the sink, if possible. But we need to get a, um, a door in. Can I get, like, a staff door in? Was staff doors a thing? I can't remember. Hold on, let me find out. Elegant door, detailed door. We'll go for a beginner door. Boom. There we go. Oh, this is so exciting, guys. This is so exciting! Right, walls. Okay, leave it as that. Leave it as all that now. So I kind of want to move now the furnishing stuff. So just move this. Rotate. Drop it there. So the staff members could walk through. Stand at the cash register. Cook up some delicious, delicious food for your boys' little fast food joint right now. So what else is there? Anything else? Seats. Can I squeeze in some double seats here? 
All right, let's squeeze him in there. It's quite an awkward restaurant we kind of build him. But it's going to be pretty good. So, box storage. Oh, that's the manager stuff. Kitchen, services, cash register account, and miscellaneous. Right. We'll keep it like that because we only got 5,000 remaining. So, we need to get some staff members in. So, we're going to hire a, a cook. We're going to hire a cashier as well. Right. So, we got two members of staff right now. So, all we need to do now is sort out the supply chain. So, we need to stock some of this stuff. So... Okay, right. Can I stock five of each? So order five of those. Wait, you don't have enough storage space? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Have I, already, I think I've already got stuff stocked. Oh, I've already got stuff, guys. Oh, no. Sediac, what have you done? i got to change my camera angle, guys. i got to change my camera. I've, I've zoomed him too far. Camera, no, not inverted. I forgot how you do it. Wait, movement mode, camera mode. Um, Am I stuck? Wait, no, no! No, I've zoomed in and I can't zoom out. Oh, there we go. There we go. Whew, whew. Touch and go there for a second, guys. Touch and go. Um, okay. So I think we've got stuff in stock. It did say in the supply. Um, stock five of each. Oh, yeah. 35 at the bottom. Right. We've got the goods. I think we're now literally ready to open up the restaurant. Yeah. Granted, it's got no roof. I understand this, but I kind of feel like it's better with no roof. Like how that dude's done it over there in the distance. It's kind of better with no roof. I like it. Where's these counters? Oh, they're over there. Okay. I was thinking like there's nothing to put across there. It'd be cool if it had like half a wall that you could put across the top. That'd be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Right. Anyway. Um, okay. Options. No, that's not. Where, where's the bit for the, um, is it, is it, no, manage. Ha ha. Are you ready for this? Oh, guys, we get to name the tycoon as well. So give us some name suggestions in the comment section down below. And if you can think of a pretty cool name, I'll let you rename the restaurant in the next episode. So open it up. We're now open for business. Right, we got somebody coming in, guys. We got somebody about to enter your boy's um, fast food restaurant. Uh, would you like... Oh, oh, this dude's, this dude's eating in. Got like a hamburger, some coleslaw. Right, dude. You got the message, hamburger, coleslaw. Right, what's he getting? He's getting, is he getting the coleslaw first or is he getting like the patties? Wait, wait, wait where's he going? Where's he going? You best not be frying the coleslaw. Damn fool. Right, hold on. P cooking up some burgers. Delish. Oh no, we got a queue. We got a queue, guy. Dude, quick. We got people. Um, um, we'll be with you one moment, dude. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, he got the food. $320? Um... Now, I'm not going to say that that was cheap. I'm not going to say that was expensive. But, oh my goodness, God. <laughs> Could you imagine paying $320 for a burger, some coleslaw? I like it, though, because that gives us lots of money to expand very quickly. Right, I didn't quite see what this dude ordered. Oh, he's frying up something good. We got another customer. <laughs> Guys, this is so dope. Could you imagine we start to expand and we start to build a restaurant like that dude's over there? That would be so damn good. Nuggets and coleslaw. Oh, they're eating together. Not even friends. Are you friends? Oh, he's got the fried chicken. He's got the fried chicken and some lemonade. Right, in this supply section, we, we can serve them apples. Because that's what that's what, that's what you want from the fast food areas, isn't it? You always want your apples. Woo -hoo -hoo. Where are you going with that food? Get out of here. This is the kitchen. <laughs> I think she's waiting for a table. Right, we can, we can make some buns. Some chicken legs, coleslaw, nuggets, patties, potatoes. Make all the good stuff in your boys. Fast food joint. Right, so we might need to get some more tables down soon. And buy more tables. We need to slightly expand the area. Oh, we could do with a trash can as well. Right, furnish. Miscellaneous. Where's the trash cans at then? Is it services? Toilets? Trash bin? Oh, you need to be level 3 for a trash bin. Have we just unlocked the toilets? Yeah, we're now level two. Is this dude hiding? Hey, dude. I see that angry face. He has got a mouth ready to chomp down on them Senny burgers. Oh, I, oh, but I'd say we got like a big queue right now, but there's somebody in the middle. <laughs> I thought we had three people. Where's the janitor? Oh, hold on. We need to hire a janitor. So hire a janitor. He's going to come in right now. Start cleaning up the place. Don't worry. You can eat your delicious burger in no time. These people were, uh, were kind of... Oh, she, those nuggets look so good. Oh! They look like popcorn chicken you get from KFC. Damn! Um, guys, 
I'm creating the greatest, greatest little builder the world has ever seen. Right, let's slightly expand a little bit then. So let's go to build. Let's go to uh, flooring. And uh, is this stone flooring? You can't build when the store is open. Ah, okay. Right, manage, manage, manager. Sorry, guys. The store is now closed. We got to do some, some expansions. Right. Can I not build? Have I got to buy? Upgrade. Aha! I got to buy more land. It's going to cost me a thousand to go in this direction. Boom. We just bought it. Okay, I don't want to upgrade the sign or anything else just yet. I just want a little bit extra room. You know. So we can have a few extra seats or something like that. Maybe a toilet down. I don't know. We'll kind of find out. So, stone. Right, we'll place all this down. Right, and we got to delete that. Yes. Right, let's delete all of that. Oh, no, I could have kept that in. Oh, I'm so dumb. I could have kept that in to kind of close off the, um, the kitchen. I'm so stupid. I am so stupid. Don't talk to me. I'm stupid. <laughs> right, walls then. So what we originally just did was delete those walls. Right, boom, boom. Right, one there, one there, one there. I'm leaving gaps there for windows. Windows, windows, windows. All righty. It's pretty smart. It's pretty smart. I can't wait to unlock. I'm just looking at all the other stuff we get to unlock. I can't wait for that stuff. That's going to be kind of dope. Right. Okay, so furnish then. I'm going to actually move this table and chair over here. Uh, just kind of put them there. Um, I could turn that. I mean, is it too much to get a toilet in that gap? We'll leave that because we can. It would be like a corridor to further expansions in that way. Uh, but seats. How much? 500. Okay, we got the monies to do this. Seat there. Seat there. Seat there. Okay, we got seats for days. Uh, no plants, no okay, cash rich toilets. Okay, we won't place those in just yet. Because, you know, expensive. We need more money to do future upgrades. But now we've got room for more seating in your boy's restaurant. Hey, well, it's hopefully, hopefully, more peeps can come in, sit down, eat those delicious Sadie burgers. Did I open this place up? Did I? Your store is now open. There we go. I don't, I'm not sure if I opened it. I actually, if I clicked the button or not. But the nerds come in. What do you want to eat? How can I help you? He would like a hamburger, apples. And I would like uh, a drink. Right. Awesome. Sweet, mate. Is it worth getting a second chef? Just to kind of speed up the process, maybe? Um, I don't know. I don't know. We'll kind of see how things go. I mean, there's another dude waiting right now. I, I wouldn't say it's worth having a second cash register just yet. Maybe worth having a second chef. But then again, like this dude's here right now. He's ordering food and there's no one waiting behind. So it's kind of not needed, is it? As much. I mean, somebody's about to come in right now. He's getting his delicious food all cooked up. You're eating that delicious burger with your apples and your drink. Do you know what I actually really like about this game? And I've only just kind of noticed this is they have in their hand exactly what they order. So if they ask for like a burger and a coleslaw, it shows a burger and a coleslaw on their tray. Like he has the burger, the apples and the drink. He has the uh, the chicken, apples and the drink as well. I wonder what this person's getting. Ooh, what did she get? She paid 400 smackaroonies for it, though. Whatever it was. Chicken and the apples. Damn. t t tasty Right, notification. Paying $75 to employees. Go for it. Go for it. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm sending this mode down here. We need to get some more supply on the go. So we've run out of um, nuggets. So order five of those. Uh, what else are we low on? We get a couple of patties. Get some potatoes in. Can I not order them? Oh, they're coming. Oh, is this why I need to get like the delivery driver thing? Is it a delivery driver? I get some buns. Right, is that how I get it? 
I need more nuggets. They're coming. Is that where you have to get the delivery? I've selected it. Is that how I get the delivery? Or do I have to go... Where do I get... How do I get this stuff in? Did I miss it on the help section? Hold on. Um, sales, manage, uh, engineers, cooks. Okay. Supplies. Last year, much make sure you have a supply. Supply, right arrow, order. It lowers the level order. It arrive. Oh, it arrives in 30 to 60 seconds. Gotcha. Gotcha. So, have we got it in yet? Yes. We've got them in. Gotcha. That makes sense because obviously you got to order it rather than just getting it. Makes complete sense. They get delivered to your restaurant like that. Guys, this is too this is too real life. This is too real life. I'm I'm enjoying it too much right now. We're also killing it right now. Killing it. Right, okay. So we're on our way. We're trying to grind up to level three, which unlocks the like the kind of the trash bins or whatever they are. So I think we need to serve two more customers. Because I think we're getting like a hundred XP per customer. Alright, boss, the order's now in. Do I get like a, a second cook? Right, I've just, I've just, I've just kind of hired a second cook. So we got one on the grill, one on the fryer right now. Double team in this. We're gonna, we're gonna get stuff cooked twice as quick. Right, nuggets and French fries. Right, so one goes to the, uh, the refrigerator, to the fryer. Off he goes. So I think that's all he kind of wants is nuggets. And, was it nuggets and a drink? He's also going to the fryer too. I think this is where we might need to have um, multiple fridges. I, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to remember how the game originally worked. Right, I get rid of that extra chef. I think it was on the lines of like um, you can have multiple fryers and, and uh, fryers and like. Ovens and cookers, whatever they're called. And I think it's the fridge that, obviously, if one chef uses the fridge to cook, that fridge can't be used until that, that original chef has finished cooking. It's classed as still in use, if that makes sense. So until we have another fridge. Oh, durability? Are we going to repair this? Staff. Engineer. Right, I've just hired an engineer to come out and fix some stuff. Because it's, it's getting beaten. But we're now level three. So hopefully now then, if I go to furnish, miscellaneous. No, it's not miscellaneous. Is it services? The trash bin. Oh, we can't do anything while the store is open. Damn it. Wait, what else have we unlocked anyway? Well, we have a quick look. So we've unlocked the second sink. Nice. Services. It's just the, it's just the, the trash bin I want. Maybe a few plants now. We'll save the plants. But we got the good stuff right now. Is the um, Has the engineer done what he's need to do? Isn't it's still going to be ticking along with it? I'm going to close the store for now, so I can. Oh, not this one. I can then furnish miscellaneous. No, those services trash bin. Trash bin. There we go. And I think that means the customers can then put their own trash in the bin. Right. Do we just let the engineer? We'll just let the engineer do his thing. And slowly start to repair everything. We have a car in the car park. Whose car is it? Is it your car? Did you park your automobile here? Hmm? He, he is... <laughs> he's trying to eat his chicken nuggets and his apple pieces and I'm just standing on his table. Like, damn, Sonny, like, damn fool. So durability is solid for that cooker. It's 16 for the fryer. 19 for the, uh, the fridge here. Which he's doing his job. Can't complain about the engineer. But guys, this is where I think I'm going to end it for today. We have a pretty sweet, basic fast food restaurant underway right now. If you guys did enjoy this and want to see me turn it into a series where we create the beastiest of all beasty fast food restaurants. Like McDonald's, Burger King, KFC. We're going to call it, what do you call it, Sunny Burgers? One, give me some pretty sweet names, just for the rest of in the comment section down below. If you want to see me turn it into a series, make sure you smash that like button and drop a comment saying, Sadiac, you're full.
play some more, and we'll do just that. But until next time, guys, I'll see you all soon. So, good bye. Listen. <laughs>